guys, remember the internet setup in my house? We've got the internet coming in here, then it goes around up to this router up here on the shelf. But since we've got a wall in between, that black thing there is an antenna cable. And there's a sector antenna mounted here, which throws the signal upstairs to another ASUS router, which is working in a bridge mode with this one. But in this mode of operation, part of the throughput is eaten by the routers communicating between each other. And then serving other devices is not as efficient as if they were connected by a cable. Still to alleviate that, I got this, a Zixel PLA 5456 power line adapter with 1800 megabits per second transfer speed over regular power lines. So we'll see how that works out and let's get on with the unboxing. Okay. Regarding the transfers, they're not that bad in this current setup. The largest problem for my son are the very long pings, which affect especially Fortnite play. So this hopefully will improve things quite a bit. Okay, really nicely packaged. Bottom used on Allegro, a Polish service similar to eBay for a fraction of a price. I think so, like half of a price of new ones also bought one single unit on ebay which is still on the way because besides the network going upstairs i want to set up a point here with a wall projector so i'll be able to transfer video over the power lines so not to have any cables going from upstairs to the tv set here so we can do some Movie projections. Okay. Let's worry a bit, there will be no Ethernet cables, but these are included. So these look like they have been never used, even no signs of dust. Okay, supposedly plug and play, pre configured so they're paired, so shouldn't be anything you have to do although if you do there's a reset encryption key to pair them on the bottom i think that's what it's for i haven't looked at the manual yet so i'll be showing you the actual setup not to fiddle around with one hand with a cell phone recording and the other one with a cables and everything so i'll just plug this in configure everything i'll show you the finished setup as well as the resulting throughput hello again guys as you probably see by the t-shirt it's day two of my network configuration and everything works perfectly as you can see the power line adapter is added here so compared to the previous setting that cable on the back it goes up here all the way to the router which has a built-in nut DHCP server and then out of this router it comes back down through a second cable and that's plugged in on the bottom of this power line adapter and then another one is upstairs and the output from the power line goes into the input of a second router and that one provides the network upstairs I had a bit of a problem with setting that up because I mistakenly set both devices as routers so each one was creating a separate network with a DHCP address assignment and a separate NAT. So right now only this router has DHCP and the one upstairs is just an access point. So this way we have a single network. All the devices, including the ones plugged into this one, see each other because I've got a camera and other things plugged here. So everything's working perfectly. I would even say it works better than expected because I'm paying the provider for a 50 megs connection 
And as you can see by the attached movie at the end here, with a speed test, I'm actually getting something around 70, both symmetrical, uplink, downlink. So it's working great, which is very important for YouTubers because you download alert stuff once in a while, but the uploads are quite frequent. And with a connection of one, two megs as somebody told me they have, even though they have a hundred meg connection, the uplink is really terrible. So here, it's gonna work really nice. By the way, this is a very good uh, provider connector. So if you're in Wrocław in Poland, I greatly recommend their services. But as you can see, a link defined as up to 50 megs is even up to 70. Whilst a friend of mine has orange network up to 100 megs and he's rarely exceeding 20 megs transfer. It's one of the outskirts of Wrocław with a small houses. So that's probably the reason they don't have a nice pipeline going out to the outskirts, but they shouldn't be offering links like that. It should be offered as up to 20. So that's it for tonight. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and now take a look at the speed test results.